they all, they all think I'm crazy. No, I'm not, I'm not crazy. No, 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 no. No, they don't, they, they just don't understand. They don't, no, 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 no. They're just, they're not taking me seriously. That's it, that's it, that's, that's all, that's it. What's going on, everybody? So, I was thinking that this Q&A would be scrapped, but I was like, no. I'm just gonna make the video and, you know, I'm going to say how literally no one asked me questions. <laughs> and once I saw it, it was like 18 hours later, I was like, oh, so nobody asked me anything. Besides two of my friends, Waffle and Remy. Here are the questions, I guess. Uh, well, actually, before I get into that, I would like to tell you guys to, I would like to let you guys know about how 104 is actually working. Still, just to give you a little refresher, just in case y'all forgot. Hello, everyone. These are the up-to-date videos by yours truly. You'll see day 68, 70, and a bunch of 70s, 60, 52. You'll see a day 35 and 45 in there. Maybe give me your ideas so I can do it in a beauty about way. Go for it. I would like to make this as interactive as possible. Give me your ideas, complicated or not, I'll do it. Well, I'll try to, you know, okay. You got that? You got all of that? So yeah, so for the next up-to-date video, which is day 28, put in the comments of this video or in any of my videos or something. So since I'm already voice overing a lot, what I said right here doesn't make sense. Basically what I said is leave in the comments your ideas because I'd love to make them in a video, okay? Yeah, so... I have a problem, right? Well, it's not necessarily a problem, but I posted on my community tab. Are you waiting for all of 104 to finish just so you can binge it all at once? Yes, I'm not watching it for that reason. Or no, screw that noise, man. I'm going to watch a video right now. And it got 50-50% and it was four votes, which is kind of not even uh, that big of a deal. But like, you know, I 104 is interactive. So like, you need to be here. I don't exactly want you to wait until the whole thing is finished and then watch it, you know what I mean? And the ending is just so special to me, and it's the whole reason why I did it, 104 and stuff, and I just feel like people need to be there for it. Okay, yo, I am getting extra nervous because I was trying to upload the video just now, and I just wanted to make another note that I do know that there's like 10 or 12 of you out there, which is awesome who are coming back to the channel and uh enjoying the videos and stuff and i i really appreciate that i'm just saying this in the video so far to the people that are just going to who just have planned that they're gonna wait for the whole thing to come out and then binge it like that's all i'm saying I, this is to those people not you guys okay uh nailed it <laughs> and um, I'm getting nervous. You can tell I'm, I'm trying to clean my my dog tag thing. But uh, I, it's just because I don't want to be like that Twitch streamer that said to her audience like, "Oh, you need to pay money or something like that." You know, all, you remember all that stuff. Because if and when I get my career, I would like to keep it very much. So. <laughs> So I don't want to be too rude about it. Definitely try to keep up with the videos is what I'm saying, right? Uh, I also want you guys to tell me what kind of up-to-date videos that you would like me to do. So I need you to be here for that. And also, we could have some clothes coming out. For free. For you. Three of the winners. I I'm going to make a video about it probably in the next week. In a two weeks, two weeks and a half or something like that. About it. But um, eh, I feel like... I need to step up this content though. I do feel like I'm not being taken seriously. I'm gonna go and meet Waffle, Kayla, and everybody in Pennsylvania. Moving on with the questions. I can do another Q&A on another up-to-date video, but here are the questions, right? Waffle has asked some, a few questions. He's asked me like five questions. Me has many questions. Started with one, now I have more. Number one. What kind of bender would you want to be, and how would you use those powers to your benefit? I would be the avatar, straight up. 
I'd be the Avatar, master of all four elements, baby. I'm joking. If I had to pick one, though, I think I would probably pick, um, maybe, I feel like air, because I'm, I'm a very bouncy person sometimes, but, uh, and my friend, we've, act I've actually had this conversation with my friend, Carson, and, uh, he says that he would be earth or fire, I actually don't remember, and that I would be air. But I'm not sure. Probably either air or fire. And if I were to pick air, I would probably do some kind of like Spider-Man stuff or something. Like if I'm lazy, I could like air bend something to me. Like you can like put little breezes and have it come to you. And I would also like, if I were to be exercising or something, <laughs> I would do, you know when Aang did that one thing, one time when he was doing push-ups, he did two hands, one hand, a finger, and then just his face, his, his, he would blow on the ground. And I would also try to, when I would be running, I'd like air bend behind me to make me like pick up the speed and like help me get momentum back and stuff. It'd be crazy. If I were to do fire, I'd just be like, oh, campfire. <laughs> when is, when is Waffle versus B2 Bot? Will Steve Gnarly and Butt fight on the undercard? Are you talking about like, oh, fight? Okay, I was trying to make a joke like, oh, B2 Bot, Waffle versus B2 Bot, what? Like golf or something? But, um, I don't know. When, it, when is it? I don't know. I'm not gonna do any boxing match unless it's actually legit. I wanted to tell you that in the Who I Want to Box video, but I'm not gonna do any fighting until, like, there's actual, there's an actual, like, you know, stadium and stuff. Like, this could be years later. This could be so far later, because 104 doesn't look so hot so far. I'm not gonna lie, like, it might not happen. But And here's where I start worrying about the failure of 104. Uh, this, it just, just please share 104. Please. Please. Unless there is actual refs, actual paramedics, there's actual rings, there's actual prizes, there's actual, you know, audiences, I'm not doing it. And unless it, it goes with my schedule and stuff. That too. But, uh, Steve Gnarly vs. Butt would be cool too. The more you know. Dream vacation spot? I don't know, man. I think that I would want to do vacation somewhere that's... Actually, I don't know. That'd be kind of scary. I was gonna say I would like to vacation somewhere that's like rural and like not necessarily country, but like more wildlife than the concrete jungle that is New York and Los Angeles. <laughs> but, you know, at the same time, if there's like, you know, it, it could be, it could get a bit sketchy. You know what I mean? Like in the wilderness. Let's say you're in the wilderness or something. Like some kind of nice wildlife thing. You 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 take the wrong turn. You you get off the path and you forget where you are. You're stranded. Next thing you know, you're eaten alive by a bear. Ah! But like at the same time, I was thinking I could get mugged <laughs> in huge cities, but it's also pretty in the cities, but it's also loud. In the wilderness, like, you know, I, I know that you're trying to ask for like a location, like Greece or uh, Japan or, or somewhere in Canada, like a Canada or Greenland or Iceland. Iceland would be actually really cool. And so, so would Alaska. I think I'd pick either Iceland or Alaska, to be honest. Somewhere in Canada, somewhere up north. I would go there. Everywhere else, I think it'd be too damn hot because it's really near the equator and it's really fucking hot over there. What about y'alls? What would be y'alls? Review all four Shrek movies with less than 10 words each and rank them. <laughs> okay. Shrek. We're gonna do we're gonna do it not in order. So Shrek 4. Shrek 4 Okay, I get I got word counts. Shrek 4. This is very scary and I once pooped my pants. Shrek 3. I think this might be some kind of anime filler. <laughs> <laughs> Shrek 2. This might possibly be the best movie of all time. <laughs> yes! Come on! Shrek 1. Shrek 1, 
Th this is all first try, by the way. No editing. Uh, okay, okay. Shrek 1. You can't go wrong with it. It's the first movie. Ah! <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so. I'm actually. I'm actually giggly right now. <laughs> All right, so I'm kind of doing this part of the video off the cuff because I forgot to uh, rank the movies, right? So obviously with Shrek 1, it's the first movie. You can't go wrong with it, like I said in this video in a very legendary way. But I would give Shrek 1 about, about like a about like a 8.5. I'll give that an 8.5, right? Shrek 2. Uh, for Shrek 2, for that movie, Shrek 2, I'd probably give it like a 9.5, maybe 10. But I'll, I'll give it a 10, right? For Shrek 3, for Shrek 4, I would give that one actually a strong solid 9. I know, I always say how I don't like Shrek 4, right? Because it's so scary, but I don't, it, it's not that often that you come across like movies that make you feel actually terrified. You know what I mean? Yes, I think it's scary, but you can like scary movies, right? So that's what I would give Shrek 4. Okay, last one. Who is your favorite Pokemon? I don't have one, dude. To be honest, I don't have one. Pikachu. Pikachu. Because he's, uh, he's very, he's very cool. Pikachu, man. Also, Mewtwo. I actually like Mewtwo. I also like Charizard. Charizard. Charizard's really cool. Oh, Snorlax. Snorlax could be one of them, actually. Snorlax. I really like Snorlax. I'm ha I have, like, a, like, a tape. Like, a v v VCR tape. A, a VHS tape of uh, a Pokemon movie a a given to me from my cousin. And... It, it had Snorlax on the cover, and I always looked at that Snorlax thing, and I was like, what the hell is this? And then I moved on, and I watched Bob the Builder. It was it was a crazy, crazy childhood. I loved it. But I, I liked it. Uh, Snorlax, so... Uh, <laughs> I guess I do have a favorite Pokemon. There's literally two more questions. Hi, did you buy Billboard for 104 Beep to a Bot? Said my friend Raimi. Yes, I did. I did buy a billboard. This is a huge project, right? So I, I gotta I gotta hit hard, dude. I gotta be a heavy hitter this 104 season. And um, I, I really don't understand why people would wait for everything to come out just to watch it in the end. I mean, like... And this is where I have another meltdown about the failure of 104. <laughs> Please share it. Please. I would love to get the word out and have people come and watch it, you know what I mean? Because this project literally means everything to me because it took up a huge chunk of my life, like huge. And for the last question, where do you think you'd be right now if you never met Wolf? Probably the same spot that I am right now. I mean, it's, I'd be one less friend, right? Which would be kind of, which is kind of depressing to think about. But now if I, if where, if the question was, where do you think I, you'd be without having met your mom or dad or uncles or cousins or something like that, family, other friends, then it would probably be a different story, but it's uh, different with that would make a difference, I think. So yeah, please watch the videos as they come out. <laughs> I put a lot of work into these and uh, you know, I just want to see it do well, and I'm going to step up the content. Those who miss it, they just miss it. But yeah, I hope I'm not too pushy. Oh my god, I'm gonna try to edit this so I don't seem like a... so negative or something. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> see you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Uh, I forgot to... I forgot to show, um, Vinji and Vinya. Hi. Beep Tweebot.